In one of the prophecies from the book of Micah, the prophet talks about a place called Zion and a place called Jerusalem. Many people believe this Zion and Jerusalem are the same place. Latter-day Saints believe they are two separate places, as is evident through our tenth article of faith. We believe in the literal gathering of Israel and in the restoration of the ten tribes, that Zion, the new Jerusalem, will be built upon the American continent, that Christ will reign personally upon the earth, and that the earth will be renewed and receive its paradisiacal glory. <sighs> Okay, let's break this one down. The ancient prophet Israel, also known as Jacob, had 12 sons. Their descendants became the 12 tribes of Israel. An ancient conflict caused the kingdom of Israel to divide in two. Ten tribes became the northern kingdom of Israel, and the tribes of Judah and Benjamin became the southern kingdom of Judah, which settled around Jerusalem. Over the next several hundred years, the northern and southern kingdoms were conquered and carried away captive by their conquerors. It really just happened once for the northern kingdom, but it happened a few different times for the southern kingdom, namely at the hands of the Babylonians and the Romans. We believe the Jews, or the kingdom of Judah, will once again gather to their promised land, the Palestine area. Uh, in fact, it's been happening for some time now. The northern kingdom of Israel was conquered by the Assyrian Empire in 721 BC. Those ten tribes were taken captive by the Assyrians and scattered throughout their empire. However, the scriptures tell us that at some point, a group from those ten tribes escaped and fled north. We don't know where they are, but through modern revelation, we believe one day those ten tribes will reveal themselves. We believe Zion, or the New Jerusalem, is a place where Latter-day Saints will gather and build a city in preparation for Christ's millennial reign, which starts at his second coming. Modern revelation has indicated that the location for this New Jerusalem will be in Missouri, because, hey, it's got to be somewhere, right? When Christ reigns as king over the earth, we believe the earth will be sanctified or made holy, restored to a Garden of Eden-like state. Christ will usher in a thousand years of peace on the earth, which we call the millennium. We'll have an entire episode about the millennium coming out in the future. That was a lot of information in a short amount of time, so I've included some helpful links in the description below that delve a little deeper into these topics. And if you want to know more about what Latter-day Saints believe, keep an eye out for our next video coming out soon. We'll see you then. And that the earth will be renewed and receive its paradisiacal glory. Did you like that? <laughs> Let's go back just to the intro.